what's the level of frustration when you guys feel like you're right there and then kind of losing the game at the last minute? Uh, I wouldn't say it's, I mean, it's frustrating, obviously. But we just had to find a way. We just had to find a way to continuously get over that hump. Obviously, we had those ebbs and flows that, during the game. And uh, for me personally, I just say, I just had to make all the plays, 100% of the plays that come my way. Like one of the missed sacks, I feel like that would have been critical if I would have got that one. Uh, and then, you know what I'm saying? We just had to find those little small little details to get over that hump that, that we need to be great. Josh, just said you felt like as a whole, you guys were playing well, and then it was one or two breakdowns. You feel like that's when it's been coming down to just one or two breaks. Yeah, I feel like just by every game that we lost, besides one, I feel like it's always it always comes down to that one one or two plays. Uh, you never know which one it is, so that's why I say you just have to go in and capitalize on 100 percent of the plays that come your way. What do you think has to change necessarily with the defense in terms of the mentality, maybe just to finish, just to to, to get that extra, you know, whatever you need. Uh, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't say anything has to change. It's just the sense, sense of urgency has to ramp up um, from the start to the finish. Obviously, I feel like we didn't come out how we supposed to come out fast, physical, things of that nature. Uh, so we just have to amp up the intensity coming out and then finishing as, as well. Is that what you need to do to get over the hump or is there anything else? Uh, I mean, definitely that's that's part of getting over the hump and like you say, just execution and all all three all three phases coming together like we did last week. Uh, obviously, it was very clear that all three phases came together last week, and that's one of those things that we have to try to continuously come together with each other as a team and uh, do. Hey, Ron, what's it like when you guys are doing some good things and it still doesn't end up the right way to feel good in here? Uh, that just, just just goes to show you uh, this game is all about the inches. Um, and within those inches, you just have to dig into those little small details like I continuously keep saying. Uh, it's always going to come down to those one, two, or three plays. And I feel like once we start executing, obviously it's going to be ebbs and flows of the game, but once we start executing the majority of those plays as a collective, as a group, everyone, all 11 on the field, then I feel like that would be us getting over the hump. You feel like the, the momentum shifts back and forth because you guys aren't playing complimentary football. When you guys do something good, it seems like the offense might not be in rhythm and then vice versa sometimes. No, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't even say that. It's just this is football, and uh, obviously it's going to be ebbs and flows in every football game, no matter what. It's, nobody's perfect. I'm not trying to say we, we got to obviously want to go out there and be perfect, but nobody's perfect in this game. Uh, it's a hard game of football. They get paid just how we get paid. So, like I say, we just have to find those little small details. Did they surprise you? a little bit uh, at the end of the game uh, throwing it, but did you think maybe they were playing for overtime at all? Uh, no, they did everything that we were expecting them to do. Uh, came out, tried to continue to run the ball, run out of clock, and I mean, we just had to get out the field. I, I know most of the injuries were last on offense, but what that next fan of mentality and seeing guys step up kind of said to you? Uh, it says a lot. It's the NFL, so that's how it's supposed to be. It's next man up. Um, I mean, it's nothing that you can do alone. Like like tomorrow, Monday, we got to come in and get treatment. The ones that's banged up, we got to come in and get healthy. And then it's on to the next. It's a week-to-week -week league.